Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Wasteland 2. <clears throat> so, we're up at Highpool. We finally managed to sort out the wreckers at the lower level. We've got a quest to go and finish them off at their home base. And now, we have to try and help fix things here before the main irrigation system decides to blow up. Now, I won't lie, it's been a little while since I've uh, since I've played this, so hopefully I can remember what's going on. Rangers, you gotta help me! One of the wrecking crew's mortars landed right on my roof! My house is burning down! Please, you gotta figure something out! Right, now, I know for the first part of fixing this, you gotta use this valve on here. However, normally I have somebody with the mechanic skill, but I don't this time. So, I believe we've got to talk to him again once we've attached that. And worse than that, the main speaker pipe is right above the house. If the fire melts the valve seal, we lose all our water. You seem to know a lot about pipes. What do you do here? I I'm the guy who fills our customers' water tanks when they come for refills. The crane holds the tanks up here, and I attach them to the main across from my house. The pump water up from the aquifer, then send their tanks back down to the caravans. Ooh. Never had this before. If you get the pressure right, you could pump just enough water from the aquifer to put out the fire and not destroy your house. Wait, no, that isn't... What? Well, now that you mention it, it that might just work. Wow, thanks, actually genius. I could do that. Since you already fixed the valve, I'm in business. And we get this guy to put his water out. Uh, put his fire out, even. Doi. That's pretty cool. Oh, but there's so many different ways you can complete quests in this game. It's so good. Alright. This fucking wreckers really mess things up around here. Alright, over here, if... Oh, I've got to level up. I'll sort that out in a second. Okay, so we have a hidden entrance to a subterranean cave, and I'm going to activate that shrine after I come over here. Uh, right. First of all, you got to talk to these little brats. Uh, Snotty brat with a cruel streak and attitude. They breed a mean here in Highpool. Howdy, gang. Maybe they've got smokes. Give us some coffee nails or Nico Pops. We need a cigarette break. Uh, why don't you take this wrist rocket with a little target practice? You could help keep the town safe if more wreckers show up. You're so stupid, yo. Wait, that actually sounds pretty rad. Maybe even gnarly. One problem, we ain't got no ammo. Well, we'll take the slingshot, but we ain't moving till you find us some ammo. Well, we've got some marbles there I'm sure you could use for ammo. First good idea you had all day, dickface. Dudes, let's go get some target practice. Little assholes. Right. There, <laughs> Vulture Cry. Trying to be all noble Native American. Doesn't look like a record to me. Right. The woman appears to be a Native American. She has hard, proud features and wears worn leather clothes and an assortment of feathers in her hair. Thank you, Desert Rangers. I have heard that your tribe brings justice to the wastes. Then bring justice here, and free me from this cage. I would travel with you if you would have me. There is much I can help you with, and you can help me as well. Hypo's holding you unjustly? They speak lies of me. They say I am a spy for the ones you call the Wrecking Crew. I am not. I came not to raid, but to trade. Mm, so you have no affiliation with the Wrecking Crew? They live in the desert, but they are not of the desert. To one who knows the ways, they are easy to trap, and easier to kill. And what do you have to trade? I come bearing seeds from my native land, ready to trade for cargo we do not possess. These seeds are strong, they grow with little water, with them your lands can thrive again. 
but though their crops are burned, these water hoarders will not trade. Instead they call me spy and put me in their cage and allow their juvies to torment me. So those juvies were giving you a hard time? Pig faced little punks. They all need a serious spanking. <laughs> and there's a break in a noble vibe. Did I say that out loud? Oh well. So much for the noble savage act. <laughs> hey, I'm still a 100% red-blooded all-American Native American, just like I said. But all that talking like an 800-year-old wise woman, well, not to be insulting, but you foreigners expect that stuff. I can get double the price for my seeds when I do the whole let me teach you the old ways speech. Who are you calling a foreigner? If you're not Indian, then your people weren't born here. And that makes you a foreigner. Sorry, Kimosabi, that's just the way it is. <laughs> what kind of cargo do you need? There are many things that we require. Water, livestock, medicine, books. How do you feel about the Desert Rangers? You guys are supposed to be the good guys. I hope that's the truth. Um, what can we do for you? Well, see, I'm not from around here. My tribe lives beyond the wall of radiation to the south. But a couple of months back, the winds shifted, and a low rad path opened up between our lands and yours. It looked like it was going to be stable, so me and some pals decided we'd come north to trade. It... it didn't go well. We got jumped by raiders our second week here, and my friends... I was the only one who escaped. But when I turned around to go back home, the winds had changed again, and the path? It was gone. The way back to my family, my tribe, my kids. Just gone. I hung around, waiting, but it never opened up again, and I didn't know if it ever would. So I decided the best thing I could do was see as much of this side of the wall as I could. You know, collect new wisdom to take back to my people. I if I can ever get back. Of course, the first place I came was here, so... Mm, not so much wisdom yet. But I'm hopeful. <laughs> which is why I'd like to travel with you. I know I was putting on an act just now, but I really can do everything I said. I can track, tame animals, heal you, help nice. you find water, and I can handle myself in a fight. What do you say? Can I join your party? Yes, you can. Great. Then get me out of here and let's get going. Uh, what she actually said there, one of them was a lie. She doesn't actually start with the healing skill. Uh, locked. Ah. Hmm. Don't have anybody with lock picking. I think I'm going to have to try and talk her out of that. Uh, talk to somebody to get her out. Um, now. Who do I need to speak to? Um. Jail door is quite massive. There's no budging it, but the lock mechanism looks pretty simple to trip. Not if you don't have anybody with lock picking it, ain't. Alright, let's get this out of the way. Uh, hmm. I know. Let's try and talk to that Sean guy. I don't think he's going to help us much because he's a bit of an arsehole. The wrecking crew are still out there, Rangers. And our irrigation system's still busted. Am I going to have to call the Red Scorpions? Go on <sighs> then. Remind us why we agreed to your protection. Douchebag! <sighs> How to get her out of there without lock picking? I suppose we could try and blow the gate. Hmm. 
Hmm. Okay, no one said I wasn't going to save scum, but... Oh! Oh! Ah! Hmm. What's the quick save key again? I can't remember. Controls. Quick save, F9, okay. Do we have any dynamite? Is that a pipe bomb? Really don't want to waste that pipe bomb. You're as honorable as people say. Let's go. Come on, let's get out of here. That might have been slightly overkill. Well, she's free anyway. I'm sure they're going to appreciate me blowing up the lock on their uh, <laughs> uh, their prison. Right. Oh, there's a, a what's it over here. Dirt pile. So we'll dig that up. Hopefully we get some goody goody goodies. Nope. Right. We're going here first. This is where they arrested me. The owner betrayed me. Sounds like a bit of a douchebag. Small man with sharp eyes and soft hand, he flicks a fly away with his swatter, then gazes deeply into your wallet. Well, howdy, folks. What can I do for you? I got guns, ammo, armor, medical supplies, and smokes. I'll also take almost anything you got in trade. Snake squeezing, scrap metal, broken weapons, odds and ends. Oh, heard that you got the prisoner out of lockup. I thought uh, for sure we'd have a hang in after Bergen arrested her in there. Yes, uh, if she was still arrested in here, do you still have the gear she was carrying? Uh, yeah, I guess I do. I was going to add it to my Stark figure, its commission on the trouble she caused. Hmm, yes, Dark Raven, come on in here with the uh, hard ass approach. That gear doesn't belong to you. Hand it over before we take a cut of your inventory. Alright, alright, no need to get hostile. You rangers really haven't changed. Here's the gear. Um, don't need to worry about any other pump and stuff. Alright, goodbye for a minute, because we're going to get Vulture Cry. Right, now that's a 6AP G43, and I'm telling you now, that's going to bullets. So you can have bullets old hunting rifle for the time being. We will get you a new gun. You've got the, you haven't got that greater AP Vulture Cry, so you'll be getting a 7 AP Sniper Rifle. Uh, what else? Oh yeah, you got the Unusual Bow. And that's going to bullets as well. <laughs> well, we've kind of got your stuff back. You can have your pet rock, but that's going to get sold as junk in a minute, so... Won't need to worry about that, neither. Hmm, what else we got here? Uh, yeah, Bullets is going to have this one for quite a while. Max range 30. Might actually... Oh, weapon skill 3. I can't remember who's got weapon skill now. Is it crossfire? Weaponsmithing, crossfire, yes, okay. Oh man, see what I mean? It's been a little while since I played this. No, I'll tell you what, I'm going to save it. I don't want to put that on a rust bucket. What would you got to trade? Ooh, herbicide, 157 scrap. Mm. Might have to. Hmm. 
that cell first. Junk. Oh no. Get rid of those. 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 That. That. Minus two combat initiative. Minus one awareness. Why would anybody trade? Uh, we don't need a choke. Short barrels. Crap. Well, actually, we could give that to, um... What's that, Chops? Uh, Vulture Cry, actually. Ah! Let's get rid of those. Don't use any of that. Sap Glove. Excellent. Right. How much scrap have I got now? 865. Now I know I can get a herbicide free. I might just wait until I get that one. Because at the moment. At the moment, Crossfire isn't. Uh, oh, plus one to hard ass. Why aren't you got that equipped? Because at the moment, Crossfire's not going to be putting out a great deal of damage anyway, so I might just save that. And I'm not going to buy anything from him just yet, because the guy outside at the bottom, now that we've cleared out the records, will give us a discount. A man with sandy blonde hair and a careworn smile tends to wounded high pool citizens in a makeshift trauma ward outside his office. Well, I got all the townsfolk patched up, but uh, you look a little uh, worse for wear. How can I help you with, uh, you want me to patch you up? Uh, yeah, get us healed. Sure, if you need it, just say the word. Alright, how can we help you? Well, I don't need any help, not personally. Though, uh, if you've got any skills for triage, I wouldn't say no to a helping hand. But the bigger concern is that those wreckers made a mess of our irrigation system. Don't know if you're handy with the kind of thing, but uh, Kate Preston could sure use a hand down in the cistern. And what do you think of Kate Preston? Well, she's not so good with plumbing, but she'd make a better mayor than Bergen. Wouldn't rely so much on the boot and the stick, if you know what I mean. How do you feel about Bergen? <coughs> uh, I think he's a good man at heart, but the world has treated him harshly. And he's returning the favour. Just fine as a second in command, but he's uh, too angry to be an effective leader. How did the mayor die? Wrecker shot him right through the neck, then fell from the walls. I tried to save him, but he was too far gone. There was nothing I could do. What are your thoughts on the wrecking crew? Why everybody thinks they can kill their way to a good life, I don't know. Growing things, having kids, healing the world, that's the only way. Tell me about the High Pool's irrigation system. Works like a charm when somebody hasn't blown it up. Store the water, use the pressure of the drop to bring water to the crops, but those wreckers have gummed up the work, something awful. Okay, goodbye. Right, now, uh, surgeon skill. Ooh, 100% on that one. Fix her up, bullets. Thank you, Rangers. I'm feeling better. Nicely done, Rangers. 76. Might wait a little bit for that one. 76. 26. Not going to touch that one. 91. 76. Ouch, that stung. Refreshing, though. Okay, mm. taking a gamble here, guys. Don't let me down, bullets. Ooh. Okay, 76 on that guy. And 76 on this guy in the corner. Come on. You're on a streak, bullets. Don't critically fail. 
Ah! If you need any medical supplies, then please help yourself from the stash over by the wall. Did he give us the key yet, though? Ah, wait a minute. 